We're back with more commentary. And this time we have Yusup, the plant extraordinaire, versus Boat, the inkling player. Between Yusup, Lugia, and there's another one that I don't remember the name of. This region has quite a few plants for a character that's really either one, not very good, and two, not very popular either. There are a lot of bad characters that are still relatively popular. Uh, let me think. Oh, Incineroar used to be bad. Um, D Donkey Kong. Uh, Ganondorf. But not that much for plant. Maybe it's the turtle play style. Maybe it's the, uh, lack of, I don't know, explosiveness. Either way. Yusup is currently getting lapped in percentage right now. And uh, Inkling, while is, is a very low risk, low reward kind of character. So as long as you play button down and uh, play polished, there's really not much a character like Plant can do to her. I mean, you can try, but right now she's, uh, she's putting the co codename Kids Next Door number fives on her, on little Plant here. I, I gotta give it to Yusup. They're definitely trying to get this kill. By any means necessary, you're gonna get blasted again. Yeah, oh my god. I don't know about this one, Chief. Boat looks like one to look out for, that's for sure. Can anyone stop at this pink menace? It just doesn't look like Boat has any intention of actually interacting with Plant at this point. Um, and Plant on the approach kind of sucks, it's as most turtle characters do. That's the problem with turtle characters. If you lose a lead, if you don't get an early lead, it sucks. You gotta really outplay. And these, um, oh my god. I never thought I'd see a Plant have so much trouble recovering. Good stuff to Boat for, uh, with really well-placed uh, ink bombs, always having the ink to do them. Oh my god, she almost died. Hello, hello PS2. And uh, also with a really clean uh, down tilt. Two frames. Right, let's see this. They were definitely waiting. They were definitely waiting. See, when, they, when you crouch like that, it makes your opponent um, aerial down, and, and your opponent wants to aerial down. It makes them aerial down at a very specific point in time because otherwise they're not gonna hit. Unless your character has like a big sword that they can swing all the way down, like a hero fair or a Nike fair or something like that, um, there's no mix up allowed. Uh, so that way, the Inkling knew exactly when to put their shield up and uh, also dissuaded any sort of tomahawk attempts by having no shield up. They, they could have just sat in shield and waited. Um, but you can't sit and shield and crouch at the same time. So, good stuff to Boat, um, if that wasn't indeed their plan, because it worked. I'm not sure about the town and city pick uh, for a character like Plant that kills off the top against a character like Inkling that struggles to kill regardless, unless it's at the side of, the, of town and city. I guess they wanted less root. Oh my god. So far, so good. And like I said, Plant, sort of this uh, spiked wall, literally, um, as a lot of turtle characters are. And once you get the lead, it can be hard to get back from. Nice mash, otherwise that would have been kind of bad for uh, for Yusup there. But yeah, that's too much rage. Plant's too heavy. And uh, it doesn't look like Boat really has to care about these these little, like, plantisms off stage. You're done. <laughs> he said he hates this game. Why were you rapid jabbing in the middle of town and city, though? That's that's what I want to know. 
What's funny is when the, they do the long stem strike and they get buried from across the stage. Yeah, see, Yusup saying he hates this game as he's getting rewarded for being hit um, with that Patui. Just uh, everything's, everything's relative, you know? Still in a much better position. Oh, not if they don't. Okay, I was expecting F Smash, but maybe F Smash is too slow. Uh, and now you're going to be taking a whole lot of damage from this ink. Perhaps enough? Not enough. Didn't get the, the first hit the, to give him the right damage. Landing Patui as a sort of aerial, kind of like a Steve Minecart situation. Like, or, sorry, Steve Anvil situation. Nope. That's not going to be a kill, but... This game is sort of getting away from Yusup here. What the heck was that going to accomplish? I guess they wanted to make him buffer an air dodge or something because that move was never going to make him trap the tech. But not everybody would know that because who does that? Bro. Okay. Uh, Yusup caught, caught swinging again. And I, I get why. You really want to take this first stock. But uh, Boat is just dancing around right now. Is that a Patu... Oh, you're going to take a whole lot of damage, a whole lot of ink here. Can you cancel Patui like that? Or you just sort of don't, don't, like it doesn't go back into his mouth, but oh my god. What frame is that, like nine? I think it's pretty quick. Actually gets hit, that does 26 into the Patui, into the forward air, we're at 58, and it's still going. Don't go down there, oh my god, I, I said don't go down there, it's not worth the risk, instead Yusup shuts me up and says, look how risky this is. Boom, frame nine down there. Except he's getting hit by every ink bomb known to existence. Are we gonna see something silly happen? No. Good discipline on Boat to not try to mash something and end up getting a buffer to, buffer kill. That's, okay, Yusup's going for shield breaks now, which I think some poison would, would be helpful for that. And now you're dead. DI the right way? Nope, doesn't matter. Too much ink, too much ink. Too much ink, dang. The second game was a lot closer though. But uh, Yusup was caught swinging a little bit too much, a little bit too often.